Emergency use COVID-19 vaccines continued in La Crosse today. Residents and staff at Bethany St. Joseph had their first opportunity to receive the Moderna shot. News 19's Marcus Arsvold followed the pharmacy workers distributing that vaccine. And Marcus, I imagine this was an exciting day for many of them. Heather, the energy was full of enthusiasm today, especially for one resident who had just moved in to the facility when the pandemic began. 86-year-old Ginny Dockweiler had to quarantine in an unfamiliar place when she moved to Bethany St. Joe's. And that was hard to, because you didn't know a soul and to, you wanted to, to be able to get out and you wanted to be able to visit people and you couldn't do any of these things. Her family is excited too. I would be among the first to get them and, and they were very thrilled. I'm good to go. You are good to go. <laughs> this isn't Ginny's first vaccine. She remembers surviving the smallpox and polio pandemics. That we're finally at the point where we can start to get uh, back to normal uh, somewhere down the road. Larry Pup says hopefully regulations can relax by February. That's our, our hope is that we can open up to visitors after the vaccination process. And then Ginny will be able to see her loved ones. I'm excited about being able to see my family again. And get out and do some of the things she loves. Like maybe I can go out and get somebody to take me shopping again. Now, if everything goes according to plan, Ginny will hopefully receive her second dose in February. And Dustin, again, the staff says they're so hopeful and that things seem to be moving in the right direction. They're yeah, seeing a lot of hope right now. Thank you, Marcus. And the staff at Hillview Senior Living Center are set to receive a vaccine shipment tomorrow.